I'm just going to do a really quick video on how to physically reset your Google Wi-Fi. Now, when you physically reset, what happens is you actually do not get rid of all the Google data or the actual Wi-Fi set up on your app or on the Google Wi-Fi network. You have to wait six months of non-use for that to happen. I'm just doing the physical Wi-Fi reset. I already did the factory reset through the... Uh, uh, all the removal through Google. Now I'm going to show you how to do a physical one. So this one is uh, pulsing amber, which means that it's reset and ready for setup. So let's do another one so I can show it to you. I just thought I'd do a video just to make it uh, easier for some people to do a physical one. This takes about five minutes to get to real quick. What you do is, okay, so what you do, you hold this down for about 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Plug it in, the power. And once it starts to flash blue, you can let go. Solid blue, then it should start flashing blue with the button still being held. You can let go now. And it should turn a flashing amber. I'm sorry, it should stay a solid blue. We'll see. It'll turn into a solid blue. And then it will start. Uh... Okay, there it goes. It's resetting. And then after this is reset, if you're not connected to a network, it'll flash amber. If you're connected to a network, it'll flash blue. I believe in both cases, you'll still be able to set them up, but it's better to have it amber, so that way you're totally set up. So this is not connected to the network, it's totally gonna be reset. And the whole process takes about five minutes. So I was setting up several of them. I'm gonna to have to keep resetting this one and this one, um, but these are ready to go. I'm resetting four of them. So uh, I did the same procedure on all of them. These took on uh, the first try and these I'm still working on, but that's how you reset it. But sometimes you have issues, you may have to do it again. So I'm gonna try again with this one. Again, unplug. Hold the button down. I like to hold it for 10 seconds before I plug it in. And it should be about 10 seconds before it starts to flash blue. And again, it'll either be amber pulse or a blue pulse. I got a blue blue pulse. So that means that the... Uh, okay, now I let go of the button. The blue pulse means that the software reset that I did didn't take. I don't know why. That's the way these new networking devices work sometimes. It's, it's odd. I miss the old days where you locked in and reset it. But and let's try it again on this one. And I'm not going to have you wait five minutes. Hold down the button. Plug it in. And I've been, I've been working with these for a while for different people. And... Uh, Okay, there it goes. And it takes some time, two, three, four times to try it out to see which one will work. So this one seems to be on setup mode now. But it, again, it took me about four times on this one. Let's check. Let's okay, finally, this. it's on setup mode. So these are ready to go to set up. They're coming up under the software to set them up. Perfect. And so are those two. All right, so I hope this video helps. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching. This is the hard reset, not the software reset. Uh, I did that and it didn't take. I just am, I'm selling these. So I want to double check and make sure that they are reset and they are reset. All right. Thank you. Bye.